guys welcome back to my life is roxy and today i have another painting video for you guys and it is the new painting green list i know i've already made a painting green list video it's the most um, popular video on my channel but i decided to make the updated updated version of the painting green list because of course the painting green list did change and yeah i thought it would only be fair to give you guys an updated version of the list so with that being said uh let's get into the videos Hola. So the painting list has eight categories i believe in the previous list or the previous green list there was only seven categories but if you guys are very familiar with painting you would know that the fruits were normally reserved for the orange list which is the sometimes the list that you can sometimes eat from but let's get into the video and let's start by explaining what is painting so painting is a low carb high fat medium protein diet um or how we like to pref um to call it it is more of a lifestyle than a diet it's a diet that is very popular among south africans it is also a diet that is very similar to the ketogenic lifestyle so in the painting diet we have the green list we have the orange list and we have the red list now the green list is the list that we are always allowed to eat from so if you want to lose weight really fast um i would say or i would my advice would be to you guys is just to stick with the green list um don't eat from the orange list it's not like it's not that I'm saying that you shouldn't touch the orange list, but in the beginning when you start off with painting, it is always said that you should try to stick with the green list. You can start eating from the orange list if you want to maintain your weight, but preferably stick to the green list. So the green list is the list that you are always allowed to eat from. This list is the list that you can eat from until you are full. There are a few foods on the green list that you need to watch out for um, onions or cooked onions is one of them but as I go through the list I'm going to give you guys some pointers so as I've said there are eight categories in the painting list the first category is the animal protein the second category is the dairy products then after the dairy products we get the fats and we also get the flavoring and condiments and we also get the sweetness which is the fifth category of the list then we get the nuts and seeds and after the nuts and seeds the seventh category we have the vegetables and now the newly added category of the painting green list which is the fruits however it is not all fruits but it is the new improved the new and improved now, let's talk about the first category of the painting green list which is the animal protein we have meat we have poultry of course you guys know what that is it's different types of meats different types of um, chicken that you can eat um, one thing that I've seen which is very popular amongst banters is chicken feet so people really try to make the painting very interesting these days so we also have the traditional foods um, I've not really eaten any of these traditional foods but it looks so delicious and interesting you have the Mumpani worms and you also have the locusts so so south africans and namibians and everywhere around the world i'm so glad that everyone is trying to make painting not only a healthy experience but also a very fun and interesting experience as well so the second category is the dairy products now i have a lot to say about dairy products but i'm going to try to keep it brief in this video because i just definitely feel like i can have a separate video on dairy products but i'm just going to give you guys a 
few products that you are allowed to eat so the first one is cottage cheese we have cream cheese we have full cream milk try to stay away from low fat um, dairy products normally when a product is a low fat it just means that there has been sugar added or other preservatives added to replace the fat in the um, milk or dairy products so one of the most important things and i want to write it on the screen remember the dairy products like milk and ama amasi i'm really not sure if i'm pronouncing it correctly and yogurt um, unless you are tracking your consumption the general guide suggests that you own you should only consume 100 ml in total of any of the three products so basically if you're going to eat one of these three products or drink or consume any of these products just try to keep it to 100 ml because the carbs can easily add up and we want to avoid you going over the allowable allowable carb limit in painting so with that being said there's also one important thing that i've also mentioned previously in one of my videos is that if you are lactose intolerant try to stay away from um, dairy products obviously i think this is like the most obvious thing but um, i know some people are not aware that they are lactose intolerant and yeah try to limit your dairy products although i am absolutely I love dairy, I love milk, I love um, cheese and all this stuff but try to limit your dairy products especially when you have a lot of weight to lose but still um, dairy products is on the green list so yeah you are allowed to eat from it but I just thought that I need to give you guys some warning points so that you can make a fair decision on your own. So um, category number three, it is the fats. So there's a bunch of fats. Like I've said in, um, previously that the protein also contains fats, but obviously there are different so, um, types of fats we get the monosaturated fat and we get the saturated fat i did say in my previous video that i'm gonna make a separate video about that so today we are just going to go briefly over the types of fats that you are allowed to consume so i'm gonna read from my list so if i'm looking down just know you can have avocado oil which is great you can have butter you can have macadamia oil and one of the most important things and which is very important to me is mayonnaise like i can literally not stay without mayonnaise i've tried but i cannot it's just one of those things that i have to I just have to eat it so i know there's probably a lot of people that feel this way but when you use painting when you use or when you want to use mayonnaise try to make sure that you make your own mayonnaise um i will try to give you guys a recipe in a later video just on how to make painting mayonnaise but um you do get the carb smart i'm going to pop a photo of this mayonnaise where you can buy it at woolies yeah if you're in south africa namibia or wherever you can buy this carb smart or maybe if anywhere in the world but you can buy the carb smart mayonnaise or you can make it at home um i would still prefer making my own at home so with moving on from fats we have the flavoring and condiments now this was like really one of the things that i struggled with when i just started learning about painting i wasn't really sure and you know there are certain times where i still a bit struggle and i know some people can really relate with this but you have to make sure when you buy or use any type of seasoning or flavoring in your food is just to make sure that it doesn't have unnecessary carbs in it and not any sugars so basically anything that is on the red list which i'm going to discuss in a later video just try to stay away from it try to keep your 
um, flavorings or your condiments or any seasoning that you use on your food try to keep it free from sugar as well as seed oils so category number five the sweeteners they are three sweeteners that i'm gonna pop up on the screen and you guys need to really look at this and these are the sweeteners that you are allowed to use during your painting diet because obviously you are not allowed to use sugar I hope it is obvious I know I hope everyone knows that you're not allowed to use sugar so yeah you're not allowed to use sugar but you are allowed to use these three sweeteners so take a look at them write them down pause this video just do anything that you need to do just to remember the sweetness because I know a lot of people really like to eat food that you have to add sweetness in so yeah you can use these three sweeteners but try or absolutely stay away from sugar category number six which is the nuts and seeds um these um nuts and seeds are mostly used during snacking and i know i mentioned in my previous video that i basically prefer to stay away from snacking but if you are the type of person that would like a snack now and then um this category is um probably the category where you have to pay attention to this is also the category where you really have to be careful that you don't overeat on nuts because nuts has a lot of hidden um carbs so you don't want to uh, um, overeat on the nuts and then wonder why you're not losing any weight so with that being said um, i'm going to mention a few nuts that you are allowed to eat from so first of all um, let's start with the seeds you are allowed to eat sunflower seeds if that is something that you enjoy doing um, but of course you have to be careful check your carbs uh, then we have the walnuts and the pine nuts and the almonds now although you are allowed to eat these foods and they are great snacking foods um, you need to be careful how much of these nuts and seeds that you consume because it might be the reason if you do find yourself eating uh, nuts and seeds a lot and you're not losing weight this might be the reason why you're not losing weight um, so just be careful for that because the carbs can add up really fast and you might go over the allowable carb limit so category number seven it is the vegetables which is of course the most favorite category on the green list um, like i said in my previous video vegetables is not only important in the painting lifestyle it is it is basically important in any diet and yeah so you are allowed to eat or leafy greens you are allowed to eat asparagus you are allowed to eat broccoli um, one of the things that I've mentioned earlier is the onions although onions um, is on the green list you need to be careful for let me read it for you to you guys I wrote it down so you need to be careful because onions has an 8.6 grams per hundred gram um so when this is when the onions are cooked so you need to be a little bit careful when you eat the onions but i don't think this is really an issue if you are someone that is totally obsessed with onions i don't think you would have this problem because um, 100 grams of onions is quite a lot to eat so i generally i don't think this is a problem for many people but it might be a problem for you so just be careful for the onions but there is so much more um, vegetables that you can eat on the green list so you are allowed to eat these foods um, vegetables is not only very healthy but it is also very low in carbs tomatoes avocados and all those stuff low in carbs very healthy and yeah it's just delicious so why not eat it so the last category of this 
list or the green list is the fruits this is category number eight now you're not allowed to eat all the fruits it's not like we added all the fruits to the green list there is some fruits that you are allowed to eat from but also be careful because it has a certain amount of carbs in it so this can also add up really quickly but there are fruits that you are allowed like pickle like pickled pear raspberry blackberries and strawberries now in my opinion this is like one of the most delicious types of fruits so i'm so happy that it is on the green list now and that you are allowed to eat it now so yeah it just brings more fun more freedom and more choices to the painting list but of course check your carbs don't go over the allowable carb limit um i really don't know if the allowable carb limit changed but as far as i know it it is 40 grams of carbs per day so please just be vigilant over the foods that you eat especially the foods that come with a warning sign to it um, although it's on the green list it has a small warning sign so don't eat it in excess especially the fruit so guys with that being said we are done with the green list this is the always list the list that you're always allowed to eat from um if you are new to my channel please hit the likes and the subscribe button and yeah i'm going to come with another painting video and that is going to be on the orange list but with that being said bye thanks for watching